What's up everybody, Y Davis here, back with another review, and today I'm be showing you guys the Yeezy 450 Cloud White. Now before I get into the video, I just want to say thank you guys for all the support. Keep on liking, keep on subscribing, and it really motivates me to keep going when I see you guys liking my content. Also, it lets me know I'm in the right direction of showing you guys what you want to see. If you're new to the channel, I just want to say thank you and welcome. I drop a lot of dope content here, so consider subscribing. Also, there's a 4K video playing in the background of me. And you guys, when the news video was coming ahead of time, if you follow me on Instagram, at Davis. But let's get right into it, guys. So I won these off the Adidas Confirm app. Um, these was re-released over the weekend. And they came pretty quickly. Um, they came in like one day. They came out, I believe, that Friday. Or was it Saturday? It was Friday or Saturday, and I got them on Sunday. So it was Saturday. Um, and I was able to get these. I am an Icon member. And like I told you guys in previous videos, the higher you go up on that level, the easier it will become to hit on shoes and to get shoes off the app. So if you guys want to hit more on that app, make sure you guys start just buying a few more shoes like at the adidas store buy adidas hat buy adidas track pants and make sure you guys get up to that icon level as fast as possible so you guys are able to hit more on that site or on that app which is the adidas confirm app um i've been having a lot of success on there and lately i just been hitting left and right but um yeah let's get right into it guys so on the top of the box here we just get a 450 up there on the bottom it says adidas on the side it does not say boost anywhere on the back it says Easy 450 made by Adidas. And on the front, I did go with a size 10. Now I went a full size up on these because if you guys watched my review on these, I went a half a size up and I told you it was fine. But after wearing these for damn near every day, this is like my new everyday shoe. Um, once you wear it for like a few hours on your feet, it really does start to get tight up here and everything like that. Because, you know, I don't know why, but it really does start to get tight around the feet in the front, in my opinion. And this is a size nine and a half. So I went up to a size 10 and I like the size 10 a whole lot better on feet. Okay, so the size nine and a half is on the left. The size 10 is on the right. As you can see, they damn near look identical. But um, like see my foot is right here still at a nine and a half. And this is where it gets tight at around here, in my opinion. Now on the size 10, which is on the right, my foot is damn near in the same spot right here. So I still have a little bit of space at the top. And this one feels a lot looser than this one up here, even though my foot is damn near in the same spot on the left. As you guys can see, that's my foot and I still have the same space up there. It still gets a little tight around here. On the right one, it's a little bit more looser around here. So I already know this one is going to fit better. And I have been wearing this one for a couple months now, like almost every day. So I'm showing you guys what it looks like on my feet and where my foot is in the toe box, just in case you guys was wondering. These probably will be my new everyday, but I've been wearing these to the ground. I'm sure you got the bottom of these right here. Look at that. Even look at the back right here. My threading is starting to come out. So I really done put these to the wars. Okay. So in my opinion now, I suggest you guys to go a full size up on the 450. In my opinion, because it does start to get tight on your feet once you wear it for hours and hours and hours. All right. Now let's open up this box here. All right. We open up the box on the top of the paper. It says made in Germany. We open up this box on the inside it is swooshed inside of there like that if you guys can see it you open it up get these amazing white shoes um I, I originally wanted these in the beginning but i couldn't get them and uh retail was 200 on these resale before this restock happened was about 300 and some change now it's about like 250 to 240 so they're only like 40 bucks over if you guys are interested in copying these right now i will go ahead and pull the trigger but let's start off with the bottom of the shoe here it's just all white then we get like a whitish clearish not really clear but on the tracking pad down there on the bottom pretty dope Then we come up to this midsole that just looked like some flames and shooting up the shoe in white I'll show you guys the outside first now i'm gonna show you guys the inside okay so that's pretty dope in my opinion now if you guys are looking at that and wondering what kind of material that is that is eva foam uh that's why it doesn't say any boost on the side of these boxes also with the foam runner they come with that eva foam in my opinion the boost is a little bit more comfortable than the eva foam but these are comfortable as well i do suggest you go a full size up when you get these shoes once again i do suggest you go a full size up so if you wear a size 9 get a size 10 if you wear a size 10 get a size 11. um i've got these in a size nine and a half half a size up if you guys watch any of my other videos I always go half size up on all of my shoes and these are still tight i'm going to show you what these guys look like on feet but let's finish off with the shoe here um we also get like some gray laces on these we don't get an extra pair of laces 
which is pretty dope. I actually like these a lot. I'm um, probably gonna wear these with the purple Yeezy Gap hoodie. If you guys haven't seen that video, check that video out. But um, we also get like some really nice prime knit going around the shoe, show you guys that toe box. I'm gonna show you guys the outside of the knit. Back into the inside of the knit. Okay. Then on the back of the shoe, we get like a different tone of like a tannish gray on the back of the shoes here. All right, then we get like that sock lining going around the shoe right there. All right, even on the tongue, it's like a different texture and different color of gray or tan going up the tongue. All right, now I did forget to tell you guys, Um, I don't know when this started but um finish line has updated that app in jd sports um i actually got early access on the air jordan threes that are coming out this weekend um if you guys haven't noticed that or haven't looked at your emails you guys might want to check your finish line app and see if you got early access to the air jordan threes um they've been doing that on the app i also had got early access on the air jordan mid the linen i believe it's called but i missed it because i wasn't looking on my app and i wasn't looking at um my emails, all you have to do is use 1500 points and to unlock the early access for the Air Jordan 3. And I think you had from yesterday until, I think you have it from yesterday until Thursday. Don't quote me on the dates, but make sure you guys check to see if you got early access so you can just guarantee your shoe for pickup at your local finish line. Get right back into the shoe. So on the inside, it comes with the Ortholite insole and it says Adidas on it with the Yeezy going across. All right, and that's in gray. Okay, on the bottom, it's like gray and blue. With a little bit of speckles and paint splatters on there. All right. On the inside, we don't get nothing else on the inside. But yeah, man, I've been waiting to get these shoes. I'm happy that they restocked. Finally completed the pack. Like I said, I love these shoes. I wear them damn near every day. But now these are probably gonna take over that. But um, I'm gonna show you guys what these look like on feet. Like, comment, subscribe, show your boy some love, and stay tuned.